Hello and welcome to this week's harmonica lesson. So today I'm going to show you how to play the Sonny Boy Williamson classic, Checking Up On My Baby. So for this lesson you will need a harmonica in the key of D. The tabs are going to be up on screen, uh, so it's going to be super easy for you to play along. But before you do, let's have a listen to what it's going to sound like. Okay, so I'm going to go through all of these licks quite quickly because you can always pause the video and spend some time working on each one individually. So, first lick is going to sound like this. One. Okay, so what is interesting about this tune is that all the way through, all the licks are the same length and they're starting in the same place. So, the licks are starting on beat two. And the first lick is actually starting on beat two of the count-in, so before the backing track starts. So if you hear the backing track, you'll hear four clicks and then the music kicks in. But you need to start on click two. So if I did a full count-in first and then played the lick, it would be one, two, three, four, one. Okay, so that's something that's really important to get uh, kind of locked into your minds because it's not an easy thing and it's the whole premise of this tune is making sure that you're playing with the same gaps all the way through. So that first lick was two draw for a quarter note, three draw half step bend for a quarter note, then we have two eighth notes, four blow, three draw, and then a scooped four draw uh, which is going to land on beat one of the next bar. So all of these phrases end on beat one. They start on beat two and they end on beat one. So let's try doing that together. I'm going to do a full count in and then one more beat and then we'll start. So we're starting on beat two. One, two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, one. Okay, right. So, uh, if you want to spend a bit more time on that lick, just pause the video, work your way through it. Uh, if not, let's have a look at lick two, which is going to sound like this. One, two, three, four, one. Okay, very similar to lick one, still starts on beat two, all of the licks do. So we're starting with a two draw uh, for a quarter note, and then we're going into eighth notes. So the rhythm is a little bit different to the first lick. So we've got three draw half step bend, then a four blow. So those are two eighth notes. And then on the next beat, we have a quarter note, three draw half step bend, and then we're ending on beat one of the next bar with a two draw. So that'll be one, two, three, four, one. Let's try that together. One, two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, one. Okay, right. Now, let's have a little look at lick three if you're ready. So lick three is going to sound like this. One, two, three, four, one. Okay, so slightly different rhythm but still starts on beat two and we're starting with a three draw half step bend for a quarter note and then we have a sequence of four eighth notes which will be the four blow, four draw, four blow, three draw and then finally a two draw on beat one of the next bar. So that's and that's played with a shuffle rhythm. So remember a shuffle rhythm is a kind of humpty dumpty uh, eighth note feel. So instead of it being a straight rhythm, which would be we've got that nice kind of sway from side to side. So let's try that together. One, two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, one. 
two, three, four, one. Okay, nice, nice. All right, if you want to spend a bit more time on that lick, pause the video, practice it a little bit, and then let's move on to lick number four, which is going to sound like this. One, two, three, four, one. Okay, so just two notes in this lick. Nice and simple, starts on beat two. We have a two draw for a quarter note. Then we have two eighth notes, three draw half step bend, two draw. And then we're landing on a quarter note on beat four with a three draw half step bend. And then a two draw on beat one of the next bar. So that's. Okay, so let's try that together. One, two, three, four, one. Two, three. Four, one. Okay, sounding good. Right, one more lick to go. Lick number five. This is the tough one. This is the money lick. It sounds like this. One, two, three, four, one. Okay, so what we have here still starts on the beat two, but the rhythm is very, very different. Different. So we have a sequence of triplet licks. Um, and this is, this is something that Sonny Boy Williamson used a lot. So the triplet is a repeating triplet, which sounds like this. So that's a four draw bend, straight on, then a clean four draw, then a five draw. And the really important thing to make sure that you're doing is that that is fitting within the beat and that each note lasts the same amount of time. So it's counted triplet or one triplet, two triplet, three triplet, four triplet. So make sure that you're starting with the four draw bend on the beat. What I see a lot of students uh, doing wrong is starting with the four draw bend on the beat and then ending with the five draw on the next beat. Then that would sound like this. Which doesn't sound the same as Okay, so be very mindful of that. And you're probably going to need to spend some time building up the speed of this. So I start it really slowly. And then when you're comfortable, get it up to speed. Okay, so let's try that. That's going to be three reps of that triplet block. And then you're ending on a four draw on beat one of the next bar. So it'll sound like this. Okay. So one, two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, one. Okay, excellent. So as a little side note, if you want to spend some more time practicing those kinds of triplet licks, uh, I've got a lesson that I've done with eight different triplet licks that you can do for free by clicking on the link in the description below. So definitely check that out. Okay, before we put it all together to play as a full tune, um, there's one more lick that you've already played. You're actually repeating lick four right at the end. So that's gonna be coming up. Let's try playing through the whole thing together now. So six licks in total, um, lick four gets repeated at the end. So let's start on beat two. So one, two, Three, four, one. 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 Okay, excellent work. So, uh, what you can do if you want to download the tab for that and also listen to the audio clips and play along with the backing track, uh, you can do that by clicking on the link in the description below this video. But before you run off and do that, one more thing you can do for me, you can give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed that lesson by hitting the like button below. And if you haven't subscribed already, you can subscribe to my channel because I put out a new free harmonica lesson every single Wednesday, and I wouldn't want you to miss out on that. 
And one more thing before you run away, uh, I've got a really, really exciting workshop coming up that I'm organizing in my hometown of Edinburgh, which is one of the most beautiful cities in the world. And this workshop is going to see me joined by Liam Ward, Will Wilde, and David Barrett. So those are some huge names. And over the weekend, we've got places for 80 students to come and join us for a series of workshops with all of the teachers, jam sessions with the teachers and with the other students, as well as a performance from all of the teachers and an amazing house band. Uh, so that's the weekend of the 21st to the 23rd of July. And uh, there are still a few tickets left, not a huge amount, so if you're interested in finding out a little bit more about that, just click on the link in the description below to go to the Edinburgh Harmonica Workshops website and find out all about it and find out how you can get your ticket secured. Right, thank you very much, and I will see you next week. Take care.